Hi everyone, welcome back. Today, inshallah, we are gonna talk about the second lesson in the calculus, which is talking about the first derivative of the quotient of two differentiable functions. You remember that the quotient here means the division of two functions. Let this function called the first and this called the second. Okay, let the first in the numerator and the second in the denominator. Take the second power 2 in the denominator to find the first derivative. And here in the numerator, you find the derivative of the first times the second minus derivative of the second times the first. Again, let the function in the numerator called the first one and the function in the denominator called the second one. To find the first derivative, you find the derivative of the first times the second minus derivative of the second times the first all over the denominator power 2. Now let's see the first example, example number 1. If f of x equal x over 2x plus 1. Now the first one in the numerator is x and the second one is 2x plus 1. To find the first derivative of f of x, you square the denominator. It will be 2x plus 1 all to the power 2. And the numerator will be derivative of the first, x. The derivative of x is 1 times the second without any changing, minus derivative of the second, which is 2x plus 1. The derivative of it is 2 times x which is the first without any changing. This is the first derivative. After putting it in the simplest form, it will be 1 times 2x plus 1, it will be 2x plus 1, minus 2 times x, it will be 2x. Now cancel 2x with negative 2x, it will be 1 over 2x plus 1 all to the power 2, and this is the simplest form to f dash of x or the first derivative. Now let's go to the second example. Find the slope of the tangent to the following curve. You remember that the slope equals f dash of x after putting here x equals the point given. So y equal x over x plus 2. This is the function. At the point negative 1 and 1, if you have found y dash and substituted by x, equals negative 1, so you get the slope. So the slope is equal y dash after substituting with x equals negative 1. Now first you, have to, first you have to find y dash. y dash equals the denominator power 2, x plus 2 all to the power 2, and about the numerator it will be derivative of the first which is x, derivative of x is 1, times the second, which is x plus 2, minus derivative of the second, which is derivative of the denominator, which is equal 1, times the first without any changing. After simplifying, it will be x plus 2 minus x. Cancel x with negative x, it will be 2 over x plus 2 over 2. This is the first derivative without any substituting. After putting x here in this equals negative 1, you will get the slope. Like y dash equals 2 over x plus 2 all to the power 2. At x, at the point negative 1 and negative 1, x equals negative 1. So, slope equal y dash after substituting with x equals negative 1. It will be 2 over negative 1 plus 2 all to the power 2. It will be 2 over 1 equals 2. Then the slope is equals 2. To find the measure of the position positive angle which the tangent makes with the positive direction of the x-axis at the given point, this is the third example. Again, find the measure of the positive angle which the tangent makes with the positive direction of the x-axis at the given point. You can remember that the measure of the positive angle is theta. No, you, now you, can, you need to find theta. 
Okay. Uh, to find the angle theta, you have to find first the slope, which is equal m. Because m equals tan theta, then you can find theta. To find the slope, you have to find y dash and substituting x equals half. Put x equals half. It's the first projection in the given point. To find y dash, okay, let's start. y equals 2x minus 1 over 2x plus 1. To find the first derivative, you need to square the denominator. If you have squared this, it will be 2x plus 1 all to the power 2. And about the numerator, it will be the derivative of the first, which is 2, times the denominator as it is, minus the derivative of the second, which is 2, times the first as it is. So it will be 2 times 1 plus 1. Here we put x equals half. 2 times half equals 1 plus 1 minus 2 times 2 times x. 2 times x equals 1. 2 times half equals 1. 1 minus 1. After calculating this numerator, it will be 4. And the denominator also, it will be 4. Then y dash equals 4 over 4 equals 1. So tan theta equals the slope equals y dash after putting x equals half. So it's equal 1. Now you can find theta which is equal 45 by chef 10, 1 equals 45. Now this is the positive angle he asked about. The homework related to this lesson is you have to solve the booklet lesson 2 in the calculus. The homework is lesson 2 in the calculus booklet. Okay? See you soon, inshallah. Goodbye.